my first weekend at Central um, wasn't too crazy, but um, it definitely was fun because this is the first week when I'm by myself and I'm living on my own. So it um, wasn't too bad. My roommate, um, I was actually separated from my roommate and I kind of ventured off on Main Street uh, with a girl I didn't really know. And uh, yeah, it's pretty fun. My average weekend here at Central would be automatically getting some alcohol. That's pretty much the first thought. Um, I, I may come back from class on a Friday, and once my classes are over on Friday, my weekend starts officially. So I'll usually try to contact someone who's of age to purchase alcohol, and then just start start drinking. Well, I think freshman party um, probably more than any other class because they're trying to, I guess maybe, to feel accepted into their new school, possibly because they're away from home, they have no supervision, they have no, you know, parents tying them down, so they're just trying to go all out. Where's the bathroom? Right around the corner. Right around the corner. Right around the corner. When I got here, I didn't know who my roommates were going to be, and I'm really glad it ended up the way it did because I love them. And they're great. It's a good time. As a freshman, it's my first year, but I'm actually doing great, way better than high school. Went from like a 2.9, 3 to a 3.6, 3.7. So, actually, great impact here. But I think it's a lot because everything's on me now, and with that, I'm being a little lot more responsible. For fun, you know, we got video games, movies, getting drunk, you know, typical college things, trolling around Main Street. Whatever. In terms of partying and affecting my school life, I don't think it's had a big impact, but it's definitely good as a stress reliever, you know, something fun you can do because Mount Pleasant, there's not a lot to do. You gotta find something fun. I'd say that um, me and Ben have probably influenced Zach um, maybe in a more negative way. Definitely a negative but, way. Um, but I, I think it'll benefit him in the long run. Um, but yeah. That's, we work good together. Are you watching World Star again? Weekdays, I'm definitely just a normal student. Go to classes, hang with my friends. I don't do anything abnormal. And on the weekends, I'd say I fit in more with the party crowd, but I can still get along with pretty much anybody. That welcome weekend, you for it's it's supposed to be like the like incredibly epic and. You know, you come here and it's like this is a, this is how college is life is supposed to be. Are you gonna be here? But you come here and it, it, I mean, it is at first. You seem like oh, I'm gonna be having the greatest time of my life. You know, women everywhere, naked, um, alcohol off the yin yang. But you only get to the point where like only things you can grasp are like alcohol, and you try and get into parties, but you. You know, a couple here and there, but you end up just getting kicked out and stuff. So, all you get is like you're drunk with a flaccid dick walking down Main Street. That's all you get. I would say the point where I really made the decision of whether college was for me or not was the minute I got here. Not the point like of oh, I I get to party and I get to like essentially like all the things that I wanted to do like smoke weed all the time and drink a lot and girls and stuff all that like came but it was more of the point of independence but when it comes to partying is like a scope we go really hard because you get very little time so you just you binge drink it all into one day so just and also you, you find yourself in situations that kind of puts you in like every once in a while you might come across a Thursday where you might black out but other than that yeah you kind of brush it off and go to class hungover as fuck the next day so every once in a while I do not go to class because I am hungover I think it's all one good experience because I mean we're not the worst of kids like we kind of we have our morals straight but I wouldn't want to be 
my roommates with anyone else because like I just know that we're just a good fit together and we all, we all like to party but we also like to have good grades you know we have our, our priorities set in, straight, in, in stone so I mean it is also a very nice factor having them here because then alcohol gets cheaper much between three. We got three rules. One, you don't commit. You, com you commit. always commit. commit. When you're in a situation, you always commit. Only when you're in a situation, all right? Number two, don't linger. Don't linger. You can't linger anywhere for too long. If it, you do start lingering for too long and one of us notices it, you say the code word. Iowa. Iowa. The secret, though. Iowa, all right? So now, sure. now, everyone. now everyone knows it. Thank you. <laughs> um, don't give a fuck. Number three, don't give a fuck. You just don't. You just don't give a fuck. You, I mean, and it works. If, if girls come your way, you don't give a fuck. But once you're in that situation where they have put you in, you need to commit. You know. Otherwise, you just don't give a fuck. We pretty much live by those three rules. Pretty much <laughs> taking us to where we are. Right now.